god. That was such a good cake. I know, right? We gotta make another one. Ooh, we should put some apples in it and make it an apple-flavored cake. Wait, I wanted a carrot cake. Nah, Ruby, trust me. Apple cake will be way better. Wait, wait, wait. Hear me out. Hear me out. What about fish cake? Ew! Gross. No way we're making a fish cake. That sounds disgusting. What? No, come on, guys. It could be good. Fish does not go with cake and... Wait, uh, guys, I think there's someone at our door. Uh, is someone there? Hold on. We should probably go check who it is. Let me just go over here and open up the door. And wait a minute. Hold on. Is there anyone here? Guys, there's a book and quill, but I don't see any people around here. Hello? Were you expecting anybody, Dash? Uh, no. Did you guys invite anyone? No. Did you order food? No, I didn't order food. Wait, did anyone order a book? Uh, no. I never door dashed a book or anything. Hmm, and wait a minute, guys. It looks like there's also a bunch of purple candles around here. It looks like there's a whole trail of them. Wait, 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 wait. What is that book? Um, I don't know. Hold on. We should probably look what's inside of it. Let me check and... <gasps> Wait a minute, guys. I think it's a note to me. It says, Dear Dash. Oh, okay. I guess it's mail. Oh, yeah. I guess it's probably a letter that someone sent me. All right. Well, here. Let me keep reading it. You probably don't know me, but I've been watching you for weeks. Uh, wait. What does that mean? Wait. Watching you for weeks? Like, uh, in what way? Dash, do you have a secret admirer? Uh, I don't know. Wait. But they said they've been watching me for weeks. Maybe they're just like a, a fan of my work or something. This sounds more like a stalker to me. I don't know. Maybe. It could still be good. Hold on, hold on. Let me keep on reading. The next thing it says is, I love you in all caps. Ooh, Dash is a lady killer. Ah, what, what, what does that mean? Uh, just don't worry about it. It doesn't mean that you actually kill the ladies. It means that uh, they like you a lot, but this is weird. Uh, wait, wait, hold on. Let me keep on reading. It says, if you want to meet up, follow the purple candles. Ooh, wait, wait, wait. Hold on, guys. I think there's like some sort of like, I think they're trying to invite me on a date or something. Ooh, well, come on, come on, come on, come on. Wait, this doesn't even feel like a date. This looks really suspicious. What? What are you talking about? How is this suspicious? They've probably just like been seeing me. That's probably why they wrote, I've been watching you for weeks. And they probably just like, I don't know, like me. I mean, I don't blame them. I do look pretty handsome. Uh, like you? They said, I love you in all caps. That's really weird. Well, it's not that weird. Isn't that just like what people write in love letters? Uh, no, not normally, but I still, come on, you got this. Okay, okay, well, guys, hold on. I guess let's follow the trail of purple candles. I mean, there's no harm in following them, right? No, there can be harm in following them. This could be a trap. What, the, what type of trap are you talking about? What could possibly be at the end of these purple candles? Uh, maybe you meet this girl and then she's just really, really weird. But guys, come on. There's three of us and probably only one person at the end of this path, okay? If they're weird, then we can just, like, beat them up. And, uh, Cam, you're not actually encouraging this, are you? What? No, I'm just excited for my boy Dash. And wait, I've got to pick up live for you, Dash. I, uh, this one always works. And wait, wait, what, what is it? What is it? Uh, okay, as soon as you meet her, you're going to want to ask her. Be like, hey, are you a Wi-Fi? Because uh, I'm feeling a connection. Eh, eh, eh. <laughs> what? Okay, uh, I, I don't know about that. But guys, let's follow this trail of purple candles. This seems interesting. I, I guess let's just follow it. There's really no harm. I can't believe I'm letting myself get roped into this. Okay, okay, guys, it's going to be fine. And whoa. Oh, okay, it looks like it's going behind our house over here. It looks like it's going all the way to the forest back there. Wait, when did they even put these candles here? How did we not notice them? We've been at home all day. I don't know. That's a good question. Maybe they put them there while we were sleeping or something. I don't know. That's so creepy. All right, well, here, I guess let's just keep on following them. It's going pretty deep into the forest, but uh, let's just keep on going, I guess. Dash and mystery girl sitting in a tree. And, well, can't, I, I don't even know this person yet. Okay, dude, chill, chill, chill. Well, I'm just predicting your future, bruh. And what? Okay, but, whoa, guys, hold on. The candles are leading into a cave. Um, Okay, this is kind of weird now. I've never had a date in a cave before. I've actually never had a date ever. Uh, okay, well, do you want your first date to be in a cave? I mean, I don't know. I, is this how dates normally go? Dash, I'm telling you this is not how normal dates go don't go down there hey dash that uh, let's do it and, well, okay i think we should just go guys come on remember there's three of us if anything goes wrong we can just run or beat up whoever this is and ooh, wait it looks like there's a staircase wow th this person is really going far or maybe they're just really obsessed with you in a bad way and, well, okay but what if they're obsessed with me in a good way i don't know i feel like i'm watching a disaster about to happen but oh, wait a minute guys it looks like they set up a picnic ah that's kind of cute but why would they set it up in a cave this is kind of a weird spot to set up a picnic and also where are they i don't see them around here a picnic this looks more like a summoning circle what, a summoning circle i mean it's a circle full of candles you never know what can happen in a circle full of candles you need to relax bro it's just a date and okay okay yeah i'm guessing they're probably just not here yet maybe they just wanted me to come here first they're probably gonna show up any second now i guess we can just wait but ooh, guys i wonder who this is gonna be i don't really talk to many girls in my free time so i have no idea uh yeah 
Yeah, sometimes I see you talking to yourself in the mirror. So uh, I think maybe a girlfriend would be good, but not this kind of girlfriend. Yeah, I talk into the mirror to practice for when I do get a real girlfriend. I think it's working. I think it's sad. I think it's working because he's the one on a date and you're not. And yeah, yeah, wait, hold on, hold on, guys. I gotta practice my pickup lines. I gotta practice my pickup lines. Wait, Kim, can I practice it on you? Um, I, I'm all right. Uh, what, Ruby, can I practice it on you? No! Okay, fine. I'll practice it on this candle. I'll pretend, yeah, this candle is gonna be the girlfriend and I'm gonna be the guy trying to walk up to it. All right, here we go, here we go. All right, all right, guys, you ready? I'm about to walk up. I'm about to walk up. Oh, no. Okay, here we go, here we go. Cam, I'm gonna do the one that you told me. All right, here we go, here we go. Um, hey, girl, are you a Wi-Fi connection? Because I'm, I'm feeling a connection. Yeah! How was that? Uh... No. Dash, I think you're starting to slowly lose your grip on reality. What, what does that even mean? Guys, that was good, wasn't it? Come on, Kim. You can tell me that was good, right? No, no. It's uh, You walk up and you go, hey, girl, are you a Wi-Fi? Because I'm feeling a connection. Uh, wait, isn't that what I said? No, you said, are you a Wi-Fi connection? Because I'm feeling a connection. Oh, uh, uh, okay. So I just have to say connection once, not twice. Okay, I got it. Here, let me try one more time. All right, guys, take two. Here we go. I'm going to get it this time. Yeah, Dash, you got this. All right, here we go. Here we go. Three, two, one. Hey, girl, uh, are you Wi-Fi? Because I'm... I'm feeling a connection. Wait, hold on a minute. Did you guys see that book just fall from the sky? I don't know. I couldn't watch. Wait, wait, wait. Hold on a minute. What is this? Wait, let me open up this book real quick and... <gasps> wait a minute. Guys, I think this book is from The Secret Admirer. It says, uh, why did you have to bring your friends? I told you not to. Wait, what? No, they did they? Uh, I don't remember reading that. They like to write a lot. Are they a writer? Wait, wait, hold on a minute. Let me check the first book real quick. It doesn't say anything in here about not bringing my friends in. Oh, wait, wait, hold on. There's a second page. Hold on, hold on. Let me open up the second page. It says, P.S. Don't bring your friends. You don't need them. What? Uh, what? Yeah. Uh, oh, it's because she wanted to get you alone. She's shy. Oh, yeah. That's probably it. That's probably it. Uh, or maybe she just wants to kidnap you, but when you're by yourself. No, Ruby, I'm not going to get kidnapped. Have you seen my mom? Muscles? I got two muscles right here. I could beat up anyone who tries to kidnap me. You're built like a dirt block. Calm down. I'm not built like a dirt block. Whoa, whoa, whoa. No, Ruby, I'm built like a netherite block, okay? Just look at these muscles. These are fists of steel right here. <laughs> I shouldn't have come here. But wait a minute, guys. Hold on. I didn't finish reading this second book. Let me open it up again, and it says, uh, it's fine. Meet me at the diamond door. Oh, oh, guys, I guess it's fine. I guess it, they're, they're fine with hanging out with you guys. Um, I guess we have to find the diamond door around here then? Oh, maybe. Uh, but wait a minute. Before we go, make sure to read the rest of that book. And yeah, 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 yeah. Don't worry. I've read this entire book. There's only one page here. There's no other pages. Oh, let's go. That means we can all meet the shy girl. All right. Well, I guess all we have to do is look around for some diamond ores. That shouldn't be too hard. I mean, we're literally in a cave. Uh, okay. But I just see iron. She probably put them somewhere here as a gift. Uh, there's nothing over here. And wait, she put the diamond ore here as a gift. Oh, gosh, guys. I didn't bring a gift. Are you supposed to bring gifts for first dates? Uh, yeah. Flowers and chocolates, bro. I thought you knew this. What? Flowers and chocolates? I don't have any flowers and chocolates. Do you guys have anything? Uh, what? Uh, no. You're not supposed to bring someone to someone asking you to go to a cave. Uh, yeah. Don't worry. That's like got you here. Just take some of these. They, they they do the trick. They work every single time I go on a date. Ew, a puffer fish, Kim. I'm not sure if it is like the best gift for a date. It's the perfect gift for the date. What? How is a puffer fish a good gift for a date? What is the date going to do with them? Uh, I don't know. Keep them as a pet or eat them. They're good. Uh, I don't know about any of that. I think we should just go home, guys. Wait, whoa, 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 whoa. Uh, wait, wait. Did you find the diamonds? Look. What, what, what? And oh. <gasps> Whoa, wait a minute. There's a bunch of diamonds over there. Wait, wait, hold on, guys. We can't go home. There's a, a bunch of diamonds here. I'm guessing this is what they set up. And whoa, there's a lot of diamonds. And check it out, guys. There's also a staircase. How did they have time to make all of this? Did you even bring a pickaxe? I have no idea, but uh, no, I don't really have a pickaxe. I guess we can just leave the diamonds here. But whoa, guys, we should go down this staircase. This is probably where they are. We get to meet them. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Look, they made all of this for Dash. What if they're uh, allergic to people whose name starts with a D? Yeah, we should go home. Well, Ruby, why would they be allergic to me? They literally sent me all these love letters. Uh, I don't know. Uh, Ruby, I think you're just being scared. And plus, look, they built all of this for Dash. We have to go. But wait, wait, wait. Hold on a minute, guys. There's a tripwire over here. What is this tripwire for? Oh, they probably set up a surprise for you. It's probably going to be fireworks and roses and a bunch of flowers and everything. Whoa, a surprise. Okay, wow. This date is really going above and beyond. This is awesome. I'm not going down there. I'm just going to stay put until all of this is over because this is ridiculous. And well, How is this ridiculous, Ruby? It's literally just a trip wire hook. What do you mean? It's so suspicious. It's probably a trap. Guys, it's not going to be a trap, Dash. You can just go on. And, okay, I'm just going to walk over and... Um, what? Uh, what just happened? Um, uh, The blocks are moving me. And wait, wait, wait. What, what, what just happened? Guys, are you all right? Where in the world did they just go? Um, Okay, well, this is kind of weird, but... Oh, gosh, now I can't get back. There's no stairs here anymore. And... 
Uh, wait, did the entrance of the hole just get covered with bedrock? Uh, wait, what's going on? Guys, guys, can you hear me down there? Oh, gosh. Okay, maybe going on this date wasn't a really good idea, but hold on a minute. Let me go down the rest of this staircase really quick. It looks like this is the only way I can go now. And wait a minute. There's a chest over here. Let me go ahead and open this up. And Ash! Wait, wait, guys, hold on. Where are you? What? Ash, over here! Wait, what? How did you guys end up in those cages? We're trapped! What the heck? Oh, no. There's a big pool of lava, and you guys are in those cages. Uh, okay, guys, M Ruby, maybe you're right. What was I telling you? Get us out! Well, now it doesn't matter who's right. Just help us get out. Okay, okay, I'm gonna help you guys get out. But guys, they left another book here. Should I read it? Yes, read it! That'll probably help us get out. Okay, okay, it says, Finally, Dash, we can be together by ourselves. Let's meet back at your house. And then a heart emoji. Oh, no, guys, guys, I think they're going to our house. Wait, what? What are we supposed to do? You have to help us get out. And, okay, okay, yeah, I'll help you guys get out. But, um, okay, guys, I don't really have any blocks, and I can't really go back up. The exit just got covered up in bedrock. Ooh, maybe I can use this chest to bring over to you guys the chest is only one block that's not gonna work and oh gosh okay well how do i get over to you guys do you guys have any ideas uh no wait look at the lava maybe there's like a uh, hidden like passage no um i don't know are there like invisible blocks or something and uh invisible blocks i don't see any invisible blocks oh gosh i didn't even bring any blocks on me so i don't have anything wait that's look in the corner there's a stair and wait wait what in the corner i, I what, what corner there's no stair over here what are you talking about all the way back there look away i'm punching all the way back there wait all the way over here okay Okay, okay, I'm going. Yeah, yeah, look, there's a little hole. And, whoa, wait a minute. How did you notice this from all the way over there? I got good eyes. Pumperfish give you 40-40 uh, vision. Wait, what? Okay, and whoa, wait a minute. Guys, there's a lever down here. Should I flick it? Should I flick it? But, oh gosh, wait, what if this lever, like, drops you guys into the lava? Uh, I don't know if you should flick it without knowing where it leads. Well, I don't see anything else. That's our only option. And, okay, okay, who's in favor of flicking it? Say I. Um, I guess I. Okay, okay, well, I guess in that case, we're gonna flick it. I'm gonna flick it! And, Okay, did you guys fall? Are you guys all right? Uh, no, we're fine, but <gasps> wait, look behind you. And, wait, wait, what's behind me? And <gasps> wait a minute, guys, I think flicking that lever opened up a door. Yo, wait, wait, hold on. Maybe there could be some stuff in here to help me. And whoa, okay, this room looks kind of old. There's a bunch of cobwebs everywhere. Wait, Dash, be careful. And oh, yeah, don't worry, don't worry, Ruby. I'll be fine. And oh, it looks like this is just a supply room. Okay, okay, maybe there's some supplies here I can use to get to you guys. <gasps> guys, there's tables here. I can use these tables as bridging blocks. Hmm, is there enough? I don't know. Hold on, let me try bridging with them. Let me just put a table right over here. Oh, wait, I placed it in the wrong spot. Wait, Dash, put them on the walls. You can parkour. Oh, yeah, then I won't have to build, like, a full bridge. Okay, okay, that's actually a good idea. Let me just break these blocks real quick, and oh, it just fell into the lava. But hold on a minute, guys. There's only, let me count. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and then uh, times two. Sixteen tables in here. I don't think that's gonna be enough. Hmm, what do we do? Is there anything else in the supply room? Anything at all? Uh, well, here, let me check. There's a water bottle. There's a jack-o'-lantern for some reason uh there's a little bit of snow another water bottle a diamond shovel and another piece of snow wait that's only three blocks the pumpkin and the snow oh gosh but hey it is still three blocks i guess i can use this to get closer to you guys wait 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 wait, wait. don't do it uh, what do you mean don't waste those blocks dash you can use them to make a snow golem wait wait, wait. a snow golem and then what do i do with that so you can get infinite snow duh wait ruby's right snow golems produce infinite snow and you said you have a shovel right wait a minute yeah i forgot God, snow golems can make infinite snow and then I can use the shovel to pick it up and then I can craft snow blocks and bridge over to you guys. That is actually genius. Yo, we got infinite blocks. Hold on. I'm going to start mining out of my cage. Yeah, yeah. You guys mine out of your cages over there. Start mining out because it might take a while with your fist. I'm just going to go ahead and pick up some tables over here real quick. Let me just grab three tables. I'm going to use these tables to trap the snow golem so he can't escape. And now let me just put these tables down right over here like this and boom. There we go. Check it out. I've got a snow golem and now I can get infinite infinite snow from it. Let's go. Let's go. It actually worked. Oh my gosh. Okay, Ruby, that idea came in clutch, but hold on a minute. Now that I've got all of these snowballs, I can use this to craft snow blocks. Let me just put this all into my crafting table, and yes, I've got 16 snow blocks. Guys, I can use this to start parkouring over to you guys. Let's go. Awesome. Hurry it up. Hurry it up. Hurry it up. I'm coming. I'm coming. Let me just keep on placing all of these blocks. Honestly, I might have enough blocks to make it to you guys right now. Come on. Let's go. Okay, I'm definitely never going on a date again after this. Well, I mean, you can go on dates. Just avoid dates on, from caves and weird notes. Yeah, I think I've learned my lesson, but here, I'm super close to you guys now. I just gotta bridge a little bit more with the snow blocks. I literally see you guys. How's it going over there? Come on, come on. I think I can jump over. Yes! Let's go! Okay, okay, and now I just gotta make it over to you, Ruby. Hurry up. 
up. It's hot in here. I'm trying. I'm trying. Hold on. I need to get a little bit more snow. I kind of ran out. I got to parkour all the way back here to the snow golem. Are you kidding me? Hey, just give me one second. And all right, perfect. I can get a bunch more snow now. Let's go. Phew. All right, I'm going to stay here and look around and see if I can find a way out of here. And yeah, guys, the exit was covered up in bedrock, so we can't go from there. All right, but anyways, I think I've got enough snow now. Let me go ahead and convert this all into some snow blocks real quick. Boom, there we go. And okay, Ruby, I should have enough to make it to you now. Okay, okay, come on. I want to get out of here. I didn't even want to be here. I'm coming, I'm coming. I just got to parkour my way over. And all right, now I can start bridging with some more snow. Let's go. Oh, come on, so close. Get me out. All right, there we are. We can leave. Let's go. <sighs> oh my gosh, that was intense. Whoever this person is, is crazy. They literally tried to trap you guys. Um, maybe this girl really, really likes you or really, really hates you. Because why would she do this to your friends? Yeah, it's either one of the two. But guys, now we got to try to get out of this place. I'm not sure if you guys saw it, but the exit is literally covered up in bedrock. We can't go through there. Wait, how did they even do that? I have no idea. This girl is pretty crazy. But uh, guys, maybe we can just break through the sides. I mean, the sides are still made out of quartz, right? Yeah, it's probably our best option. And uh, can you build over the staircase real quick? Uh, yeah, yeah, I got you. Let me just break all of these webs real quick. And all right, let me just put down some snow blocks over here. And all right, let's get out of this place. Guys, we got to break through these quartz blocks. There's three of us, so this should be pretty quick. I'll break the block at the top. All right, I'll break the one at the bottom. All right, sounds good. And oh gosh, guys, we need to break this diamond block without a pickaxe. We're going to waste this diamond block. It's fine. Let's just get out of here. And yeah, you're right. You're right. We just got to focus on getting out of here for now. Let me just break this diamond block right over here. Ah, oh, this is going to be sad. We're just going to waste this diamond here. It'll be fine. We can find more diamonds. Okay, okay. But there we go. We broke it. We just have to break this one last diamond block right over here. And then we can finally get out. And there we go. I just broke my diamond block. And wait, Kim, how have you not broken this quartz block yet? You moved in my way. Oh, oh, my bad. But there we go, guys. We finally made it out of the prison. Phew, I'm never going on another date in a cave again. That was pretty crazy. Yeah, only restaurants, okay? And, yeah, yeah. I'll only go on, like, dinner dates and stuff. But anyways, guys, hold on. Um, In that last book that they left me, they said, let's meet back at your house. Guys, I think they're at our house right now. Oh, no. Um, well, it took us so long to get out. I'm sure they're not there anymore if we're with you. And okay, okay. Yeah, it did take us quite a while to get out. Maybe they just, like, went to the house and, you know, like, got bored because we weren't there and then left. Yeah. Yeah, and if they're there, we can call the police. And yeah, 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 exactly, exactly. But anyways, I guess let's just go back to the house. Let's go up these stairs real quick. Oh, man, I can't wait to go back home and have everything be normal again. Yeah, and uh, Dash, yeah? I really ought to teach you what stranger danger means. What? Okay, Ruby, I mean, th this stranger was pretty crazy, okay? They put a bunch of books and a bunch of, like, candles everywhere. This stranger, like, went all out. I was trying to tell you that it was suspicious. Okay, okay, well, hey, I've learned my lesson now. I'm not gonna talk to any more random strangers, but here, let's just follow these candles back to our house. As soon as we get back, we just gotta keep the doors shut, and we should be safe. And yeah, we gotta make sure to lock all windows and doors and not let anyone in the house. And I guess we can clean up these purple candles tomorrow. I'm kind of spooked out for today. Yep, it's game time. And oh gosh, uh, guys, our doors were left open. Uh, did we leave the doors open when we left, or is this the crazy girl who left the doors open? I don't know. Should I check the backyard? I think we should all be together for now. Yeah, I think we should all probably stick together. Guys, remember, they could still be in the house. Don't forget, they said, let's meet back at your house. And also a love emoji. What? Got reflexes of steel. No one could jump up on me. And wait, hold on a minute. Everyone take some snowballs. If we see them, we gotta whack him with snowballs. Oh my gosh. Be on guard, okay, everyone? All right, yeah. Everyone be on guard. We cannot let our guard down. Let's just carefully enter the building. And okay, okay. There's no one around here. This area is clear. This area is clear. Ah, yeah. Let's check upstairs. And yeah, yeah. Hold on. First, we just check the kitchen. Is there anyone over here? No, no one around here. Anyone on the balcony? Uh, no, no one out here. Okay, yeah. Let's go upstairs. Downstairs is fully clear. Okay, good, good. But let's all stick together. Uh, Wait. All right, all right, yeah, let's go here and oh wait wait hold on guys We just checked the washroom. Let's go over here. Are they in the toilet and they're, they're not in the toilet Okay, and wow this bathroom is really tall for some reason. Yeah, this is my bathroom. It's pretty nice But hold on guys, maybe they could be in this room. Whoa! Is there anyone here? Uh, uh, no, I don't think so. All right, room is clear. Room is clear. Wait, wait, we gotta check the balcony as well. Hold on. Everyone check around the balcony. And okay, no, there's no one here. Guys, there's only one room left to check. My bedroom. Snowballs ready? All right, all right. Here we go. Here we go. Everyone get your snowballs out. Let's go. I know you're in here. Come out, come out, come out. I know karate. Uh, okay, guys, there's no one in here. There's no one in here. Yeah, we're good. We're good. Wait, wait. There's something on your desk. Did you write this? A book? Oh, no. Another book and quote. Guys, I did not write this. Hold on a minute. Let me take this. What does this say? It's it says you weren't 
supposed to save your friends in all caps. Um. Wait, they wrote that in all caps? That means they mean business. But uh, where are they? I don't see them anyway. I don't think they're inside of the house. But hold on, hold on. Let me read the rest of this book. It says that's it. I'll be back to deal with them in two minutes. Uh, guys, I think they're gonna come back to the house in two minutes. Wait, what? We gotta fortify the doors. We gotta um. Uh, what else do we do? Uh, we gotta. Uh, wait, 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 wait. Slow down, slow down, slow down. Hold on, hold on. Wait, let me read the rest of it, guys. There's still one line left. It says then we can finally be together dash oh no i don't want to be together with this person oh no grab all the food out of the fridge wait, wait cam why do we need to grab all the food we need to we need to grab all the food out of the fridge we need to just, you just eat it all eat it all eat, eat all the food no cam 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 okay stop 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 chill we don't need to eat all the food we're not moving or anything guys we're gonna stand our ground we're gonna stay in this house what we gotta do is build a trap at the front door that'll stop this crazy girl i don't know if it's just a trap around the door will help but let's try it and no 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 guys a trap is gonna be the best move this is what we have to do everyone start digging down over here hold on let me go grab my tools for my room all right guys i've got all my materials inside of this drawer right over here and okay this should be everything we need to build a trap let me just grab all of this and ooh, i've also got a taco in here from yesterday I'll save this for later uh, uh, wait why you put a taco in your bedside drawer yeah they're good i don't get to have them very often so i like to save them wait don't eat that that wasn't refrigerated but anyways guys what we gotta do is dig a little hole underneath the door we gotta make a big pit that we can trap this crazy girl in here one of you guys take this pickaxe one of you guys dig a big pit i got it all right all right and then ruby i guess you can help me with the redstone what we gotta do is oh wait hold on cam can you break these concrete blocks here uh, yeah all right all right what we gotta do is put down two pistons on each side of the floor like this we're gonna make a piston trap that activates as soon as they walk through the door and drops them into a giant pit okay okay and i can't get out of this pit there's a, there's a staircase wait, wait hold on did any of you guys pick up those wood blocks that i broke i need the wood blocks i have one. Oh, i got the rest there you go oh perfect thank you thank you and now the next thing we need to do is let's go ahead and put some blocks over here like this there we go and finally we need to power these pistons so let me just go ahead and uh i'm just gonna grab one of these redstone torches and put them down over here like that right underneath both of the pistons there we go and now finally we have to connect both of the pistons together with some redstone and uh, don't we need to cover this up up there and oh yeah yeah we can cover that up in a second let's just go ahead and finish up this redstone here first we just got to connect all of this and okay now let's go back up to the surface Ooh, you know what else we should do we should put down a pressure plate so that as soon as the crazy girl walks over it they fall in oh that's true all right all right here i'm just gonna dig up here real quick wait cam how's the hole going it's holing and ooh, that hole is looking pretty good well i almost fell in but here the next thing we need to do is let's put some pressure plates down right over here like that and then let me go underneath them and wait hold on ruby am i underneath the pressure plates right now um let's a uh, little to the left. A uh, little to the left. Okay, am I underneath them now? A little forward, a little forward. A little forward. Okay, am I underneath now? Yeah, perfect, 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 perfect. Okay, okay, perfect, perfect. Let me go ahead and just put some redstone underneath them there. And wait, Ruby, are you standing on them right now? No, I'm standing next to them. Wait, what? Next to them? Are you sure about that? Oh, I guess I was on them. Okay, okay, perfect. That means it works. Now the next thing we need to do is just connect the redstone up like that. And wait, Ruby, watch out, watch out. Don't stand on it now. It'll open up the door. Oh, okay, I'll be careful. And okay, other than that, though, it looks like everything works. Hold on, hold on. Let me go up over here real quick and check it out. Now, if I stand on this pressure plate, it'll... Wait, uh, the, why isn't it working? What's going on? It doesn't close. Oh, I see what the issue is. Hold on, hold on. I need to break this redstone over here that's touching the snow blocks, and I need to move it around like that. There we go. Okay, and I'll cover this up with bushes. Do you think it'll work like this? And wait, bushes? Ooh, that's a good idea. And now, check it out. If we walk over the pressure plates, it'll open it up. Oh, wait, hold on. It's not quite opening it up yet. Hold on, hold on. I think I need to put a repeater down there as well. Let me just go here and put down a repeater right over here like that and okay now if i go up here it should all work hopefully let's go oh, hey guys the hole's done Ooh, let's go let's go that hole is looking pretty good but wait wait guys hold on that hole is kind of like uh it, it, they're, they're really just a rock at the bottom we should put down like some cobwebs there so that we can trap her i want to know who this person is well do you have any cobwebs oh i have some oh wait you do okay okay perfect just drop them over to cam and he can place them down i guess oh i only have three so let's just hope that she falls into them even if she doesn't um i i guess it'll be fine i guess so but here let's also go ahead and just cover up all of this redstone so that she doesn't accidentally like fall on this platform down here i'm just gonna cover it all up with some stone and dirt there we go and all right i think the trap is pretty much done kim now you gotta get out of that hole all right i'm coming let's go and oh i see you put down the cobwebs at the bottom perfect perfect okay this trap is now fully active as soon as the girl walks through they're gonna fall yeah this just looks like a welcome mat. yeah yeah just a normal ordinary welcome mat but anyways guys we gotta be careful to not uh, hit the pressure plate and oh cam i think you broke some of the redstone oops hold on there you go but guys now every time we want to enter the house we got to be careful not to step over
over the pressure plates and uh, wait, hold on. I also gotta fix this hole over here. All right, there we go. I think everything's dying. Let's go. All right, all right. Now I guess we just have to camp inside of the house and wait for this person to come in. Oh gosh, we are getting the heebie-jeebies. What, what what does that mean? But guys, hold on. It says they're gonna be here in two minutes. Okay, they're probably gonna be here any second now. I'm staying at the window. I'm watching. One. Two. And, what, are, are, are you going to count? Wait, what? If they're not here. Not literally, Ruby. That, uh, two minutes is different from two seconds. Okay, guys. Maybe they might be a little bit late. Ooh, you guys want to bake another cake while we're waiting? <gasps> yeah, I want to eat some. Okay, okay. But guys, this time we got to make an apple cake. I'm telling you, apple cake is going to be so good. I've had it at one of my friend's houses before, and it was really good. No, no, no. Fish cake is where it's at, bro. And, no, no. Kim, we're not making fish cake. Okay, dude. Fishing is going to be disgusting. Why, why not? Um, Kim, I think we need to get you to the doctor. Your taste buds are uh, broken. But wait, hold on, guys. Did you hear that? Yo, wait, wait, hold on. What just happened to our trap? Our front door just got destroyed. What happened? Wait, what? Uh, wait, did anyone put TNT in the trap by accident? No, I don't have TNT. Wait a minute, guys. There's another book here. Um, uh, wait, did the crazy girl survive the trap? I think she'd seen it and blew it up. Oh my gosh. Are you kidding me? Wait, wait, but hold on. Let's grab this book. We need to read it. I'm just going to grab it and run inside real quick. I don't want to be out there. Let me just open up this book and... Uh, guys, it says, did you just try to trap me? Oh, no, I, I, I don't think the trap worked. Oh, no. They definitely survived the trap. It's, they're still out there. And they know that we're here. Oh, gosh, wait, wait, hold on. There's still more stuff in the book. It says, that's not gonna work. We were meant for each other, Dash. Meet me at the cave and let's talk this out. Oh, no, nah, guys, they want to meet. Do we do it? No, we do not meet with this person. Wait, wait, I think we should probably meet with them or else they're gonna keep stalking us. Mm, I'm not gonna lie. I kind of agree with Cam. If we don't meet up with them, then they're gonna get super mad at us and then they're gonna come back and destroy the rest of our house and they're, they're, it's gonna be really bad. They're just gonna keep stalking me. Um, Dash, uh, don't you remember? Stranger danger! Yeah, but they literally know where we live, Ruby. They said let's talk it out, so I guess maybe they just wanna talk it out. Well, if anyone's gonna be doing the talking, then it should be you. I guess she only likes you. But guys, come on. I need you guys' help. I don't wanna go alone. Okay, okay. Maybe this does make sense, but this is the last time we're meeting with them. You have to tell them that. Okay, okay, yeah. As soon as we get there and meet them, I'm gonna tell them that they have to stop stalking me or else I'm gonna call the cops on them. But anyways, guys, I guess let's head back to the cave. Wait, wait, wait. Put on armor first. Uh, I don't really have any armor. I'm not gonna lie. But hey, it's fine. It's fine. We can just talk it out. Okay, let's go. Let's go. I still got these puffer fish. If I need to use them, I got it. Wait, you should uh, give them a gift or something. Maybe that'll make them less angry. Oh, yeah, yeah. I can pretend like I actually like them back or something. That's a good idea. I can give them my taco. No, 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 no. Don't, don't do that. That's such a bad idea. Here, I'll get this. And Wait, what, what do you mean? Uh, just give them like a little bit of sugar or something. Yeah. They'll like it. Uh, uh, okay, I, I guess this works. I don't know how this is better than a taco, but okay. Guys, come on. We got to get moving. I've got my helmet and my puffer fish. We should be ready to go. <laughs> what, Cam? You actually brought a helmet? Okay, okay. Let's go. Let's go. <laughs> Guys, I'm freaking out. Wait, wait, Ruby. Here, you should take half this puffer fish as well. In case we need to, we can throw it at them. Puffer fish are like super spiky. They're like snowballs, but more dangerous. Oh, but I feel bad for the puffer fish. All right, but anyways, guys, we are now back at the cave. Everyone, pull out your puffer fishes. This is not a drill. This is the real deal right here. Everyone stay on high alert. Hey yeah, I'm gonna dual wield these puffer fish. And, oh, now you got them in both hands. Okay, okay, here. Let's just hop down over here. Everyone, be on high alert. We gotta be really careful. Let's see. Are they actually gonna be at that picnic area this time? I don't know, but if they are, my puffer fish are ready. All right, and... Okay, wait, guys, there's no one there, but wait, it looks like they left the chest. Careful opening that. It could explode or something. And oh gosh, oh gosh. Yeah, you're right. Hold on, hold on. Let me pull up over here and... Okay, this kind of just looks like a normal chest. This doesn't look like a trap chest, but they're not here. Maybe they're late. Uh, maybe there's like a note in the chest or something. And Oh, yeah, there's probably another note in here. All right, all right. I'm just going to move my puffer fish into my inventory. And let's see, what's inside of this chest then? Okay, guys, it's another note. It's another note. I've got so many notes at this point. Hold on. I need to put these other ones away. What does this next one say? Um, Let me open it up. And oh, guys, wait. It says, hi, Dash. I want to apologize for trying to hurt your friends. Oh, that's actually kind of nice, guys. Maybe they're like actually sorry and like want to be friends now. Mm, maybe. Oh. Oh, wait, did they say why they were sorry? And uh, here, I guess let me go ahead and read the rest of the book. It says, I want to apologize for trying to hurt your friends. I won't do it again. Uh, JK? And wait, wh whoa, what's going on? Ah! Uh, wow! Uh -huh. Where are we? Uh, guys, I think we just got trapped. I'm loaded with pufferfish. Wait, you're here too now. Oh, gosh. Oh, gosh. Where are we? Uh, and guys, I think that's the, uh, void right there. What do we do? Wait, they like you, right? Why are you here with us? I don't know, but... Wait, there's another book over here. Hold on, hold on. Let me pull it out real quick. Let's see. What is this one gonna say? If I can't take Dash, then I'll take all of you. Ha 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 ha. Oh no, this is actually evil. What? Wait, what? 
And then it says, have fun being stuck in my prison forever. What? I don't want to be stuck here forever. I don't either. What are we supposed to do? I don't know. I only have puffer fish. Oh, gosh. Oh, gosh. Okay. Well, guys, what do we do? What do we do? We have to get out of here somehow. And oh, wait, I think that's the escape right over there. Guys, I've still got three cobblestone blocks. Maybe we can bridge over there. Hold on. Hold on. Let me just try bridging up here and... Yeah, I don't have enough cobblestone. Mm, well, what are we supposed to do? There has to be a way out of here. Oh, gosh. Oh, gosh. But, whoa. Guys, hold on. What is all of this stuff over here? Wait, there's a sign over there above those carrots. Wait, what does that say? Break carrot in case of emergency. Uh, Guys, should we try breaking that carrot? It's an emergency. Oh, wait. Yeah, you're right. How are we supposed to get over there? Hmm. Wait. I see how we're supposed to break it. I, uh, look, light. Wait, what, what do you mean, light? And, oh, whoa. Check it out. There's torches over there. Guys, I'm pretty sure if we break those torches, then the carrot is going to instantly break because, you know, plants need light to grow. But how are we supposed to even do that? Uh, well, hold on a minute. Do I still have any snowballs? Let me see. And, uh, no, I don't have any snowballs. All right, Dash, throw me. And, wait, uh, Cam, I, I don't think I can really throw you that far. I don't, I don't think we should risk that. I'm not gonna lie. Come on, the spike on my helmet will act like a, as a, as a, as an arrow. And, no, no, yeah, Cam, that's a horrible idea, but yeah, check it out, guys. We have to throw some sort of projectile at that target block over there, and then it'll activate the piston and break the torch. Well, hmm, uh, let's see. In my inventory, I've got pufferfish, and, um, Pufferfish. I only have pufferfish. Oh, gosh. And I don't have any snow blocks from that snow golem that we had earlier. Well, hold on a minute. Is there any snow that we can use from around here? Guys, we got to search for snow. Is there any snow around here? Wait, I just realized something. Wait, again, what did you realize? If you didn't place those three cobblestone right there, we could have used them to walk over there and destroy it ourselves. Oh, my gosh. Yeah, you're right. Oh, okay, well, hold on a minute. Kim, you still have that pickaxe that I dropped you earlier, right? Right, right? Uh, about that. It broke. What? Oh, my gosh. Are you kidding? me okay okay well guys how are we supposed to do this maybe there's some snow blocks or something around here and oh wait a minute guys look there's a cauldron over here wait what there is yeah yeah there's a cauldron but uh i don't think there's anything we can't really do anything with it uh, dash this looks like a hopper not a cauldron and, wait wait hold on no cam you're looking at something else is there something else over here on this side and oh wait guys there's a hopper and it's got a powdered snow bucket a bunch of food and then three snowballs oh, guys snowballs this is exactly what we need yeah Let's go. Okay, okay, here. I'm gonna grab all of this stuff from this chest real quick. There we go. And okay, now that we have snowballs, all we gotta do is just throw them at the target blocks over here. Boom! There we go. And yes, we just broke one of the torches. And okay, now the carrot should break now that there's no light. Oh, no, there's another torch, but we can't break it with the snowball. Wait, wait, there is an... Oh, no. Are you kidding me? How are we supposed to get that one? Wait, why can't we break it? Uh, well, because, Ruby, look, the piston isn't facing the torch. So if we throw a snowball at that target block, the piston's not gonna break the torch. Oh, no. Oh, my gosh. Okay, okay. Well, then, guys, what are we supposed to do? We do have this powdered snow bucket. <gasps> Wait, guys, look. You can use powdered snow as a block, but you can't really stand on top of it unless you have leather boots. Mm. Well, I don't have any boots. Yeah, me neither. All I see is the rabbit there. Uh, wait, uh, hold on. Put the powdered snow bucket down real quick. Uh, okay, okay. Wait, what are we going to do here? Uh, you said there was a cauldron here, right? What, what if there's something in the cauldron left over? And, oh, wait a minute. You're right, you're right. Maybe there's like a liquid in the cauldron that we could use. And, oh, guys, it's another powdered snow bucket inside of the cauldron. Okay, now we've got two powdered snow. Okay, but now we just have two powdered snow. What can we even do this? But, oh, wait a minute, guys. I kind of have a crazy idea. I'm not sure if this is going to work but I'm pretty sure rabbits can actually go on snow because, you know, rabbits are super light, so they're not going to fall through the snow like us. Wait, wait, are you saying that we break the rabbit out? I think that's what we have to do. <gasps> wait, Dash, you might be onto something there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And hold on a minute, guys. What are rabbits' favorite food? Carrots! Exactly. Guys, we have to bring the rabbit over to the carrots because I'm pretty sure the rabbit can eat the carrots. Okay, okay, come on, let's do it. All right, all right, but guys, this is going to be kind of tough. What we have to do is put the powdered snow in the perfect spots for the rabbit to follow it. So we can put one over there and then we can put another powdered snow right over here guys we have to bring the rabbit to the carrot somehow oh gosh should we break the glass for the rabbit and yeah i think that's the next thing that we have to do i guess let's just go ahead and break that and okay rabbit come on come on come on rabbit let's go let's go guys hold on maybe if i drop some food over here it'll follow it oh check it out he's following it okay okay perfect now the next thing we need to do is put another snow bucket right over here wait ruby can you move for a sec okay, okay. let me just put a piece of powdered snow right over there and all right rabbit can you jump on that powdered snow down there that would be very very good Come on, buddy. hold on let me try dropping another carrot there for him and <gasps> wait guys look he just jumped in okay okay perfect now we just gotta lure him over there to those carrots and wait i think he's going he's going he's going he's going oh go 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 
Come on. Come on, guys. It looks like he's about to eat them. Now we just have to wait for him to do it. Let's go. Uh, it looks like he's not. He's standing next to the piston. And, oh, gosh. Wait, we can use the piston to push him in. Wait, actually, yeah, you're right. Hold on. I still have the snowball. Let's eat this snowball over here. All right, rabbit. Go into... Oh, I think I missed. You actually you actually have to hit it, Dad. Hey, well, I've still got one snowball left. Let me try that out. There we go. And hey, all right, rabbit. Go eat those carrots. And oh, oh, here we go. I think it's eating the carrots. I think it's going to eat the carrots. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Come on, little guy. Just eat the carrots. I, I don't think he's hungry right now. Uh, we have to wait for him to get hungry. Come on. Oh, gosh. All right, well, guys, I guess we can just wait around, but check it out. You see all those redstone torches over there? I'm pretty sure. <gasps> wait. I think he just ate them. Wait, it worked. <gasps> wait a minute, guys. It just gave us a shulker box. We have this yellow shulker box down here now. And, oh, wait, there's also a green one up there. That wasn't there before, was it? Can I open it from here? Uh Wait, hold on, let me try reaching up and no guys. Okay, I don't think we can open it from down here But hold on a minute. Let's check out what's inside of this yellow shulker box real quick Let me just put it down right over here and okay There's cobwebs and a gold sword with sharpness looting and unbreaking. What are we supposed to do with this? Mm, there's cobwebs and a sword. What can we do with cobwebs and a sword? And, oh, wait a minute guys. We can use it to make string. Hold on. Hold on Let me grab these cobwebs and the sword real quick and just put them all down over here and check it out guys Whenever you break a cobweb with swords, you can get string from it and oh, you guys know what we can do with this string we could use it to make wool exactly here, here here let me go ahead and make some wool with this in my inventory boom there we go and now with this wool i can bridge up even farther and now i can reach the green choker box let's go and okay guys the green choker box has three pieces of leather and three pieces of rabbit hide what are we supposed to do with this i don't know what those things make at all i think we need another rabbit hide wait why, why do we need four rabbit hide what can you do with four rabbit hide well if we get one more rabbit hide we can use it to make leather and then we use all the leather to make boots and oh, wait a minute you're right and uh guys this gold sword has looting on it which means that whenever you kill something it'll like drop a bunch of stuff i think we have to kill that rabbit uh yeah mr rabbit we're sorry and yeah okay hold on everyone we gotta make our way to the rabbit i think we can make this parkour jump yeet there we go and okay let's take out this rabbit hopefully he doesn't drop his stuff into the void come on rabbit just go in that corner over there please that'd be much appreciated Get down, down, just swing. Oh. hold on wait guys i'm gonna be careful i don't want his stuff to fall into the void uh, okay i'm just gonna take him out boom there we go and oh <gasps> Guys, I got the rabbit hide. I have four rabbit hide now. Let's go. Now, I'm pretty sure I can use this to make a piece of leather. Yes, now we've got four leather. Let's go. All right, perfect. Now, we just got to find a crafting table. And, oh, yeah. Okay, okay. Everyone, look around. We need to find a crafting table around here to actually make the boots. Ooh, maybe we can go inside of this glass area over here. Any crafting tables? Mm, I don't see anything under the bedrock island. Let me just do a little bit. A simple parkour. Boom, there we go. And, oh, guys, check it out. There's a crafting table in here. Okay, okay, perfect. Now, we can use this to craft leather boots and now that we have leather boots we can actually walk on the powdered snow let's go uh, wait how are we gonna use this to escape we still don't have enough blocks to get out of here well ruby hold on a minute check this out if you have two pieces of powdered snow you can just use it to infinitely go up wherever you want check it out guys i'm flying with the powdered snow Yo! <laughs> this is awesome and now i can make it to the exit but hold on a minute how are you guys gonna get here i guess we're all just gonna have to jump at the same time we'll just have to take turns or something wait no that's not gonna work we're all gonna need leather boots and oh wait a minute yeah you're right but hold on a minute guys uh i think that door leads to the escape maybe i can go outside escape get you guys leather boots and then come back yeah that's probably the best move we'll wait here for you all right all right well here i'll start making my way over i just gotta bridge up with these powdered snow blocks hopefully i don't meet that crazy girl over there just come back for us, okay? I'll make sure to come back. Don't worry. Don't worry. Anyways, let me just keep on powdered snow in my way up over here. Let's go. Do not fall into the void, Dash, no matter what. And yeah, yeah. Don't worry. Don't worry. I'm not going to fall into the void. I'm being very, very careful right now. Oh, gosh. This is so scary. I'm right above the void right now. All right. All right. Here we go. I'm almost there. Okay. The rest of this is easy. I can just keep going up like this through the wall. Let's go. Okay, Dash. Don't forget us, though. And yeah, guys, of course, I'm not going to forget you. And ooh, wait, Cam, you're actually getting pretty close to the wall. Maybe if I grab some of these ladders over here, we can just put them on the wall and you can jump onto the ladders. Yeah, I'm trying. I gotta go back and get more pistons. Okay, okay. Well, here, let me go ahead and break all these ladders here. I've still got my wooden axe. I'm just gonna break all of these over here. And oh, yeah, maybe I'm not even gonna have to get you guys leather boots. This might be even faster. Ooh. And wait, wait, hold on, Cam. I'm gonna drop you some ladders. Uh, try to catch these, okay? Okay. All right, three, two, one. There you go. Did you get them? Uh, no, you barely missed. Are you kidding me? Okay, well, good thing there's a lot of ladders here. I'm just gonna grab a few more over here. And okay, okay. I've now got 18 ladders. And oh, wait, you got even closer let me just drop these ladders to you real quick there you go and okay yeah you got those wait all right i can definitely make it onto here now let's go here, i'll move these powder snow out of the way i bet and me and ruby are on our way let's go we are escaped Ooh, let's go let's go okay that was actually crazy what's up a prison 
even was that? This person is more than crazy. Yeah, do you believe me now? And Yeah, Ruby, I think I'm gonna uh, take your advice from now on. But anyways, I guess let's get out of here now. Hopefully this is actually the escape. Hopefully, hopefully there's not another trap. Yeah, all right, here. Let's just get all the way up here to the top. Let's go and... <gasps> Wait a minute, guys. I think that's the sky over there. Let's go. We're finally going to be able to see the sun again. Yeah, I'm so happy. Feels like we were stuck in that void prison for so long. But wait a minute, guys. There's another chest here. Oh, no. What does this one say? What is it going to be this time? Hold on. Let me grab the book. And okay, here we go. It says, if you are reading this, that means you escaped. <laughs> yeah, we escaped. We're pretty good. That, that was pretty easy. Yeah, that was pretty easy. All right. But anyways, there's more. It says, you're not getting away with this dot, dot, dot in all caps. Huh? What? And then it says, sleep with one eye open. Uh... Wait, what? I don't feel safe. What is that supposed to mean? Uh, okay, guys, this is actually very bad. They literally know where we live. What are we gonna do? What are we gonna do? Spike helmet! And, no, Kim, Kim, you can't spike helmet everything. Okay, spike helmet probably isn't gonna solve this. This person is, like, very powerful and uh, kind of smart, it seems. Mm, yeah, my spike helmet won't do enough damage to them. <gasps> Wait a minute, guys. Hold on. I think what we have to do is fortify our house. We gotta build defenses to stop this person. Yeah, our house is that way. Wait, wouldn't building another house be better? And, no, 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 Ruby. This house was, like, uh, it took a lot of time to build. I don't want to build a new one. But they know where you live. We can build defenses. It's gonna be fine. It's gonna be fine. Oh, no. Let's just go back over here to the house and ooh, wait, hold on. There's a lava pool here. I'm gonna grab a little bit of this lava. We can build like a lava moat around the house and everything. Ooh, lava moat, great idea. Yep, yep, yep. Here, guys, this is gonna be the first step in upgrading our house. Let's just go over here and we gotta start digging out a big moat. Ooh, I've still got this diamond shovel. I'll start digging. All right, let's get this done mined out. Oh, okay, okay, I'll do this side, up, but don't touch any of the wood. It'll burn. And yeah, yeah, we wanna be kind of far from the wood. And here, guys, let's make it four blocks wide. We wanna make it so that this person won't be able to jump over it. Four blocks wide. Okay, I got you. Let's Let's go, let's go. This lava moat is actually gonna be crazy. And oh, wait, over here. Hold on, there's no blocks. I need to place some blocks over here to make sure that the lava doesn't leak out. All right, but anyways, guys, I'm digging the moat behind the house right now. This moat is actually coming together so well. Yeah, your house is big. Yep, I gotta make sure it stays defended. But wait a minute, guys. There's a much faster way we can do this. Let me just go ahead and run the command slash slash wand to grab a magic wand. And check it out. Now, if I select this position right here and also this other position right over here, I can just run the command slash slash set air and boom. Boom. Check it out. Now it's all set with air. And oh, wait, I see you fill it all with lava. Yeah. Very nice. Very nice. And okay, now we just got to fill this last area right over here with some lava. And then the lava moat will be pretty much done. This is actually looking sick. Okay, I'm going to cover up the walls and the floor because I don't want it to flood under your house. And oh, yeah, good idea. Good idea. We do not want it to burn the house since the house is like all made out of wood. But anyways, guys, I think this lava moat should be pretty good. But hold on a minute. Let's get rid of all these purple candles. I don't want these here. These kind of look gross. And oh, gosh, guys, I think we kind of got to repair the entrance as well. Oh, yeah, we don't need that trap anymore because it doesn't work. Yeah, the trap kind of got blown up. But hold on a minute, guys. This is good. This gives us a chance to make an even better and stronger front door. Let's just go ahead and repair all of this real quick. All right, let's just repair this. And then uh, what trap did you want to put here? And OK, guys, I wasn't thinking of a trap. I'm thinking, what if we put a stronger door? Before, I only had wooden doors here. But I'm pretty sure there's like much stronger doors that we could use. Let me just look around real quick. And oh, yeah, check it out, guys. We can get a keypad door. Yo! Oh, wait, what's that? Oh, pretty much what you have to do is set a code for it. Let me just do one, two, three, four, for example. And now the only way to open it up is to enter the code. And I'm pretty sure the door is also blast proof. Okay, well, let's make this code super, super hard, okay? And yeah, yeah, we got to make this code super challenging so that this crazy girl never finds out. So uh, what are we going to make it? I don't know. Something really strong. She keeps on breaking into your house. 9998. Nine, nine, what? 9998? Nine, nine, That's not that strong. That's like really simple and not complicated. Guys, we got to do something complicated. What about 13542678943212? Dude, my head is spinning with these numbers. We need something simple, though. What? Okay, guys, we have to do something complicated but easy to remember. That's what we need. Uh, 4142. Okay, okay. 4142 is not bad. Can everyone remember that? Yeah. I think so. Wait, what's the code? What? Kim, did you really just ask what's the code? I thought you remembered it. It's 4142. Pretty simple. Uh, 4148? No, no, no. 4142. Just remember that. Okay, don't forget it. Write it on your helmet or something. Okay, I'll put it on the inside of my spike helmet. 4154. No, 4142. Here, let me put it in the other door as well. There we go. And check it out. Now, the only way to enter is to enter the correct code. Boom! That is awesome. Yep, and I already got the other doors uh, situated. And oh, oh, wait. Wow, you really replaced all the doors in the house. Okay, wait. Did you put the right code in them, though? Uh... 
Did I? What was the code? Uh, let's try it out. 4142. And oh, yeah, you got it. Nice. Uh, past me is so smart. <laughs> what? Okay, okay. But hold on a minute, guys. I'm not sure if having stronger doors is going to be enough. We should also probably add some, you know, better defenses. Because what if they just, like, break through the windows? Oh, I have an idea. Get over here. Huh? Where are you? Wait, okay. What's your idea? I'm going to build a huge wall. And Wait, a wall? Hold on a minute. That's actually not a bad idea. We can just encase the entire house with a giant wall, like a castle. Uh, let's see. Uh, yeah, but a Blah, blah, blah. That and, uh, whoa, 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 Ruby, what did you just do? Whoa! Uh, let me try that again. I did that wrong. Let me do that again. Uh, I think you typed out the wrong command. Okay, give it another go and... Ooh, a big obsidian wall? That's a good idea. I like it. I like it. Mm, yeah, this one's good. Uh, I feel so much safer. But wait a minute, guys. How are we supposed to get in the house now? Uh, it's kind of just all enclosed in obsidian. Why would we need a leaf? It's so safe here. What, what, like, what if we need to get food or, like, animals or, like, stuff like that? Nope. I don't want to go. Guys, 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 I got it. What if we make a giant car ramp? And, uh, what? A giant car ramp? Cam, I don't think that's a, a, a really good idea. I don't think you can build a ramp that's tall enough to go over this wall. Says who? This ramp's going to be plenty tall. Uh, I don't know about that, Cam. It looks like this ramp is going to lead you directly into the wall. Nah, I got to check this out. Let me just spawn in one of my yellow cars. And uh, Okay, this is interesting. I have my doubts about this. Let me just line it up, and I'm going up the slope. Here we go. And, uh, uh, wait, Cam, I don't, I don't think that really <laughs> works. It looks like the car is doing the Gangnam style. Uh, I, it's just a, a minor bug. And, what? No, Cam, that is not a minor bug. That, this entire thing doesn't work. Okay, okay, guys, I have a way better idea. Yo, Cam, watch out! Fire. <laughs> you just broke the ground under him and you just said, watch out, what? You gotta be careful where you drive that thing. But guys, here's what I'm thinking. Why don't we build a big TNT player launcher and we can build it on top of my roof? Oh, wait, that's an excellent idea. Let's do it. All right, all right. But here, guys, what we gotta do first is let's go over here into my room and let me just grab a ladder really quick. We can build it on top of my room. Let me just put down a ladder right over here that leads up to the roof. And here, now let me put a trap door down here as well. And okay, guys, the next thing we need to do is everyone grab a few dispensers. Okay, I have mine. I've got mine. We need some dispensers, some redstone, some TNT, and some water. And pretty much what we have to do is put dispensers going in a pattern like this, right on top of the roof like that. And then finally, we need to put some water inside and fill it all up with TNT. All right, I got everything you asked for. Milk, flour, honey, sugar, eggs, uh, and, well, your grocery list. Cam, that is not what I asked for. I asked for TNT dispensers and redstone. We have to fill up all of these dispensers with TNT. And what, Ruby, what are you doing here? What is that? It's redstone and TNT. What? Redstone and TNT. That is not right. What the heck is that? Ruby! Oh. Was that a TNT cake? Oh my gosh. No, Ruby, I said we need redstone and TNT, not redstone and TNT cakes. I didn't know that they actually exploded and I misheard you. Oh my gosh. Okay, okay. Well, hold on, hold on. We got to repair this. We got to repair this. Ruby, you can be in charge of repairing that. I'll work on the TNT cannon. We got to fill up all of these dispensers with a bunch of TNT. And, okay, wait, Cam, have you got them all? On it, Cap'n. All right, all right, perfect. They are all filled up. Now the next thing we need to do is connect all of these together with a little bit of redstone like that and then finally let me go ahead and grab a button and check it out guys let me just put down the button right over here as soon as you press the button it's gonna fill the entire thing up with a bunch of tnt Ooh, i want to go first on the ride i want to go first i want to go first but, guys, guys, really, oh, 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 uh, yeah okay it works it works guys, watch out watch out watch out you have to try to oh okay you guys should have put on a light res uh, you didn't put any elytras here. Well, you guys went too early. I wasn't done with the build yet. Duh. And hold on a minute. The next thing we also need is a fence. We can put down a fence right here for people to stand on when they want to exit the house. And then finally, we also need to grab a chest with a bunch of elytras in them. Wait, check out these elytras. And wait, what elytras? What are you talking about? And whoa, those look like some really cool elytras. What are those? Um, here, I'll hand it to you. It's called the tarantula hawk elytra. Wait, tarantula hawk elytra? Wait, wait, is it better than like a normal elytra? I don't know. It gives you armor. Is that better? Wait, it does? Oh, yeah. It gives you plus three armor. I guess that's better than normal elytras. Normal elytras don't give you any armor. Tarantula! And, oh, oh, oh. Cam's going up. Wait, Cam, test out the elytra. Does it work? Wee! Yeah, it just works like a normal elytra. And whoa, I'm going so far. Let's go. Okay, okay. Well, in that case, let me put a bunch of these tarantula elytras inside of the chest. And hold on a minute. I want to take this thing for a spin. Let me stand right here and press the button. And all right, here we go. Here we go. Let's see. How high am I going to go? Yeah! This is awesome! Whoa, I can literally fly all the way over to that cave that we were at. Yeah, but don't, don't, don't! 
don't. Yeah, no, no. I was just going to check it out. I don't think there was anyone there, but here. I'm flying back to the house now. Let's go. But anyways, guys, we've got a way to go out, but how do we actually uh, get in now? Oh, I got it. Don't worry. We just got to stand here, and then we can uh, make a flying pig machine. And what? A flying pig machine? What are you talking about? So let me grab a saddle, and let me just put this on there, and then... Uh, why isn't it flying? And, and pigs can't really fly. What are you talking about? Okay, guys, come on. We need to come up with an actual good idea for a way to get in. We need to have a way that we can go in, but this crazy stalker girl can. Ooh, ooh, I know, I know. Wait, wait, what is it? What is it? Uh, we can just build a lava path to go in. And Wait, wait, what? A lava path? What are you talking about? Well, obviously, she can't walk on lava, but maybe we can. And Oh, wait, you mean like using striders to walk on lava? Okay, okay. I, that kind of it could work, but... Wait a minute, that actually gives me an even better idea. Guys, why don't we build a fake lava path? Check it out. Wait, what's fake lava? Oh, pr let me put it down. Pretty much, it looks like lava, but it's actually harmless. Here, Cam, try riding your pig into it. Uh, I just got this pig. I don't want to lose it, but fine. He's not going to take damage. And Check it out. It, it, it's just like water. <gasps> Yo, it's working. Can a strider go over it? And Oh, yeah, it looks like a strider can also go over it. But yeah, pretty much, it's lava that it, it, it's pretty much just harmless. But here, what I'm thinking we do is let's make like a little path of lava to go in to the house like this and pretty much we can go through it since we know that it's fake lava but the crazy stalker girl can't yeah but all of this is real lava right and oh yeah wait all of this over here is real lava here let me fill it all over here with fake lava like that there we go let's just put a bunch of fake lava over here like this there we go and okay now this entire area over here should be fake lava let's go let's go this is actually awesome that crazy stalker girl is never getting in but hold on a minute let me go ahead and clean up over here outside real quick i'm just gonna cover this this up like that there we go that's looking pretty good and all right nice our house is looking pretty solid but uh guys what are we gonna do if the crazy stalker girl has an electra and they fly in through the top uh, let's put a roof on it but wait then we're not gonna have any sunlight and it's gonna be super sad in here and then all of our plants are gonna grow and camp that was real lava there oops i didn't know that my big. but guys we can't put a roof on here because that's gonna cut out all the sunlight and i'm pretty sure you kind of like need sunlight i think it's like a good healthy oh, oh, thing i know i know Wait, what is it? What is it? Why don't we just build defenses up there on the wall? <gasps> Wait, defenses up on the wall? Okay, we can do that, but hmm, what type of defenses could we build? <gasps> Wait a minute, guys. I think I have a really good idea. Everyone, grab some dispensers and some harming potions. It's about to get crazy. Harming potions? Yep, yep, yep. I've got a good idea. Let's put a huge ring of dispensers going around our entire wall and fill up the inside of them with a bunch of harming potions. Ooh, that's a good idea. I didn't even think about potions. Yep, yep, yep. We can just have a bunch of potions splash and rain down over here all around our base but here now what we gotta do is let me just uh select this dispenser over here and just replace all of these empty dispensers with some potion filled ones and ooh, guys we can do this with commands let me just select all of this and look this way and now check it out if i run the command slash slash stack uh 50 check it out we have a bunch of filled dispensers oh i think i stacked a little bit too far that's okay let's just uh, get rid of the rest of these all right all right but here let's go ahead and put this all around the entire base let me select this and then stack it this way there we go i got this way Ooh, all right all right very nice and ooh, wait a minute guys hold on the next thing we're also going to need to do is power all of these and oh the way we can do that is pretty simple we just got to put some more obsidian on top of them like this or wait actually we don't even need the obsidian all we need is some red Redstone and repeaters. We just gotta put a big line of redstone and repeaters going all across these dispensers. Okay, I'll do the other side. All right, all right. And ooh, where should we have the switch for this? Hmm, I guess we can have it inside of my room over here. Let me just go ahead and grab a button. And here, I'm just gonna put a switch right over here on my door. And now over here on the other side, let me just go ahead and connect this switch up to a little bit of redstone. Or ooh, wait, actually, instead of redstone, let me grab some redstone torches. We can build a redstone torch tower. Pretty much what that's gonna do is whenever I hit the button, Button over here it'll turn off the redstone torch and if i build a big tower it'll turn on the one at the top let me just press that and yeah check it out it'll turn on this redstone torch at the top all right there you go all the dispensers are placed let's go okay okay the next thing we gotta do is place all of the redstone around them and here i'm putting down a big redstone torch tower up to the top to actually power it okay okay and uh can someone put down the repeaters for me and yep 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 i'll hop in a moment i'm just connecting all this redstone over here real quick there we go go and okay i think it should be functional should we give it a go yeah let's give it a shot all right all right here i'm just gonna go down here and replace this button with a lever real quick so that you know we can just leave it on there we go and okay here we go let's see is the redstone gonna be powering all of these dispensers and oh wait hold on it's only powering this way um let's put a few repeaters going this way as well okay uh i don't know if i put down my repeaters right it should be fine and whoa check it out guys those harming potions are being thrown so far this is crazy well she won't know what hit her literally 
early. Yeah, yeah. Wait, hold on. Can someone go into my room and flick the lever real quick? I want to see what this is going to look like from the outside. Oh, yeah, I got it. All right, all right. Just flick the lever once in three, two, one. And yo, that looks awesome. That is actually so cool. Yo, let's go. This stalker is going down. But wait a minute, guys. This still doesn't really solve the problem of what if she has an elytra and just flies in. These are kind of just pointed outwards, not upwards. Oh, no. No, you're right. Do we need a roof? Um, hmm, I don't really want to build a roof because remember, then we're not going to have any sunlight. Yeah, how do we put a roof without putting a roof? I got it. Um, let's see. I it. got it. Wait, I got it. What, what, what is it? What is it? We make another wall that goes to the build limit. And uh, <laughs> what, Ruby? She can still fly over that though. What? No, oh, no, you're right. But wait, wait, wait. Hold on a minute, guys. I think I might have an idea. What if we use some sentry turrets? Check it out. Hold on. Let me grab one of these turrets real quick. I'm gonna grab the heavy crossbow turret. This thing looks wild. What we gotta do is I'm just gonna put it down uh, right over here like this. And boom, guys, check it out. We got a big heavy crossbow turret. Ooh, that looks sick. We need to put down a bunch of these. Yeah, yeah, but hold on a minute. Guys, check it out. The best part about these is that they can shoot upwards and sideways. They can pretty much shoot wherever because they're like auto tracking. Let me just put a zombie down right over here and boom, check it out. The heavy crossbow just one shot at it. That is awesome. Wait, uh, hold on. Put one up here. I wonder if it'll shoot it from up here. Let me just spawn in a zombie up over here on this obsidian. And yo, okay, that thing is actually crazy. Let's go. That worked. All right, we need to put like a hundred of these around. I don't know about hundreds, but guys, what we got to do is build a big ring of obsidian around the entire walls. And then we can put a bunch of these turrets on them. Oh, wait, hold on. We have to go past this redstone. Okay, yeah, Um, I'll keep on the continue. Continuing it over here, I guess. There's other types of turrets. Uh, Dash, you might want to look at this one. And wait, wait, hold on a minute. What's this one over here? Whoa, wait, what is that? Guess what it's called? Um, the baseball turret. Kind of looks like a baseball glove. No, this is a black hole generator. A, 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 a black hole? What? Wait, wait, hold on. Uh, should we test this out in our house? Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. It should be fine. Come on, just place a zombie down. Uh, okay, I'll place a zombie right over here and. Uh, wait, it, it, it generating a black hole. Yo, yo, wait, the black hole's sticking the zombie up. What's going on? What's going on? Oh, it just took out the zombie. Whoa. I know, right? We got to use a ton of these. I know, right? But hold on a minute. There's even more turrets that we haven't tried out yet. Like, what in the world is an electromagnetic railgun? Yo, this thing kind of sounds cool. That sounds sick. Wait, what is that? I don't know. Hold on, hold on. Wait, there's also something called an acid eater level three. Should we try that? And ooh, also a firework launcher. Yo, hold on. We got to put all these to the test. Yo, wait, hold on. I found one for Roby. It's called an amethyst cannon. And wait, an amethyst cannon? Hold on a minute. Ooh, what? this. Wait, wait, hold on. Is it gonna do a bunch of damage? I guess let me try spawning in a zombie over here. Come on. And... Oh, the black hole's going to it. Oh, 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 the black hole took it out. Hold on. I think we need to test this one farther away. Ooh. I'll just remove the black hole uh, generator. Oh, God. And, uh, camp, it's, 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 chill with that thing. You don't want to break it. Okay, okay, there we go. Let's try it one more time. I'm just gonna spawn a zombie here and... Alright, what's this gonna do? And... Oh, oh, yo! I just put a... Whoa, okay, that's actually kind of cool. Oh, it's so pretty! Wait, I need to see this more and more and more and more. Come on, do it again, do it again! Whoa, relax, brother! Whoa, 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 wait, that's a lot of zombies, Reed, but... Whoa, I think this is good. I think it's making the zombies stuck in the amethyst. That is awesome, but hold on a minute. I, I want to test out these other ones. There's the electromagnetic rail gun that... Whoa, look at the range! It just shot the zombie from all the way here. Yo! Yo, what the heck? It's shooting, like, weird exploding light things. Oh, I found another uh, the turret for Ruby, a candy turret. What? What? what, what show me that! Show me that! And, oh, why, why is that a thing? I don't think a candy turret is going to do a lot of damage. Um, I'm going to test it right Right over here. Let's see. Uh, it looks so cute. <laughs> the light in the world. And yo, it should have came at the zombie. Um, it's not really doing a lot of damage, though. I think the electromagnetic railgun can one shot these things. Just like pelting candy with a baby. Oh, what does that even mean? Okay, but hold on a minute, guys. There's a few other we need to try. Let's try spotting in the acid eater level three. Check it out. This one looks wild. Wait, what's an acid eater? I don't know. I guess it eats acid. And oh, oh, it's shooting acid at the zombie. Uh, this one's all right. It didn't one shot the zombie. Oh, it two shot it. Okay, but. Hold on a minute, guys. We gotta test out the fireworks launcher as well. This looks cool. Fireworks launcher? Let's go. It looks like a crossbow with three fireworks loaded into it. All right, let me just uh, spawn in a zombie over here. And yo, wait, hold on a minute. I think the fireworks are like homing missiles. Yeah, that's sick. We could use these as homing missiles and then have like a back line of the amethyst. And ooh, yeah, yeah, exactly, exactly. That way, in case she's trying to like elytra in, these can like home onto her and stop her. Okay, we gotta use a bunch of these. We gotta use a bunch of everything. All of these are really OP. Bad. All right, I'm gonna put down some of these black hole generators. These are crazy. Oh yeah, those ones are pretty wild as well. I think the black holes are also homing. Mm -hmm. This is gonna be the best one. Wait, well, which one's gonna be the best one? Are you putting down more candy ones? <laughs> Maybe. <laughs> what was that laugh? Oh, no. Okay. I guess it should be fine to have a few candy 
ones. Uh, I, we've already got a bunch of other, like, really OP ones. But anyways, I think these turrets are pretty much done. This is looking absolutely awesome. Yeah, hopefully this is enough to keep her out. Oh, yeah, your secret admirer creeper girl uh, does not stand a chance. Oh, yeah, if she tries to break into this house again, she is going down. But anyways, guys, now that we finally have our house fully protected and secured, you guys want to go bake that apple cake now? I've been wanting to try this for so long. No, 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 no. It's definitely going to be a fish cake that we're baking. Dude, we're not making a fish cake, okay? It's going to be an apple cake. I told you, apple cakes are really good. Why not? It's not good. Yeah, fish cakes are just bad. Imagine what it would taste like. Just like a tuna in like a, 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 a mm -hmm. cake. Tuna cake. Yeah, that sounds horrible. I don't even want to think about it. Do you think this candy turret can shoot candy into my mouth? And, uh, <laughs> wait, Ruby, I don't think you should try that. that. That doesn't seem like a good idea. Uh, <laughs> put candy in my mouth. Wait, did it actually just shoot a bunch of candy in your mouth? I'm going to the bathroom. Oh, gosh. All right. Uh, no, you have fun in there, Cam. I guess now we got to bake an apple cake. Nah, bro. We're making a fish cake. And no, we're... Wait. Hold on. D uh, did you hear that? And oh, what is that big name tag up there? Oh, gosh. <laughs> What, uh, dude, did you hear that? What was that? Um, a dash? What was that? And why is that name tag so big? Uh, wait a minute, Cam. Do you think this could be that crazy stalker girl? Um, maybe? Hold on, hold on. Let me enter the code into the door real quick and just hop out over here and, um... You can't hide from me. And, oh, what the heck? I can't. I think that's a stalker girl. It's a big purple cat. Go, 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 go. What are we supposed to do? Uh, panic, 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 panic. <laughs> What's going on? And, uh, Ruby, the stalker girl is here. The stalker girl is here. This is not a drill. This is not a drill. Hold on, hold on. I gotta flick the lever. I gotta flick the lever. Take that, stalker girl. Yeah. <laughs> I still have candy in my mouth. Oh, why are you hurting me? And oh no, oh no, guys, 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 just keep standing. Just keep standing. Come on, come on. We gotta do this. Wait, that's I got bows and arrows. Come on, let's go fight. And, oh, wait, you do? Okay, this is actually perfect. All right, all right. It's time to pull up. We gotta go into battle. <laughs> And I, I think this crazy stalker girl has gone too far. Camp, we got to take her out. Yeah, come here. We got to eliminate her. Hold on, hold on. I'm going to press the button. Come on. Let me get launched. Wait, do I have an electron right now? Oh, no, I don't have an electron. But wait, wait, hold on. I can still use my bow. Take that. Yeah. Hold on, hold on. Let me get an electron from the chest real quick. And all right, now I'm coming up for real. And all right, now I'm up with the electron. Take this. And uh, guys, I think this is catnap. <laughs> Stay away from me, you crazy cat! We're gonna be together forever and ever! Uh, no, no, we are not gonna be together. Uh, come on, Cam, we gotta hit her with our arrows. Take that, take that, yeah! I hit her! Let's go, let's go! Take this, you're going down, cat! Now, this is what you get for trying to mess with us! Why is he hurting me? Stay away from our house! Never does! Wait, Cam, she's trying to come to me. Oh, gosh, oh, gosh, I don't have any fireworks. Do you have any extra? Uh, yeah, I've got a few. I can drop some. Okay, okay, quick. I need an airdrop! I need an airdrop! Airdrop, airdrop! Oh, thank you, thank you. All right, all right, let me grab these. And All right, I'm dipping! I'm back in the air! Why do you keep running away? <laughs> Take this, catnap! And, oh, yes, we got her! Let's go! <laughs> Let's go! He did it! Oh, my gosh. Finally! Now, hopefully, I don't have to deal with any more crazy stalkers. <laughs> Guys, what, what did I miss? And oh, oh, wait, Ruby, you're back. We took out the crazy stalker girl. Oh, my gosh. I just had candy from that cannon stuck in my mouth the whole time. And, oh, gosh. But I'm glad that it's finally over. Let's go. That was pretty crazy. And if you want to watch the next video, then click on the video on the screen right now.